Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. We're playing some more RuneScape. I recorded a couple of videos earlier and I've been having fun with it again. So let's just, you know, jump right back in and, you know, let's have fun with it because why not? I did check out the benefits of becoming a RuneScape member. They've added quite a bit. Holy crap. I mean, it's... Honestly, it's worth it now, which is nice. Before, all you got was just the extra game content. So, like, that was when I literally had to call on the phone just to get it. Back in the day, that was, I mean, I literally called on the phone once a month. And my grandma was none the wiser to the increase in the bill. She was none the wiser. I'm, I'm actually surprised they got rid of that option. I mean, they still might have it, though, honestly. But... I've not been a RuneScape member in years since before RuneScape 3 even. I might do it, I don't know. I mean, I don't really have a reason to right now. But we will see. I mean, I do want to do the quests. I've only done enough quests back in the past, before RuneScape 3, to where I, so that I could wear Rune Plate Body. But in RuneScape 3, or as I call it, the best RuneScape, graphically and whatnot, you don't have to do that quest at all to wear a Rune Plate Body. Thank God. You can just go buy one or in my case craft one and you're set <clears throat> and you also get your own private world kinda like kinda like what Fallout 76 offers I wonder who stole from who for the idea <laughs> I really wonder like did Fallout steal from, from from RuneScape or the RuneScape steal from Fallout. I'm curious. Who did it first? I really want to know. But I don't really need my own world because I'm an Iron Man character. I can't take anything from anyone. So. And RuneScape's a dying game as it is. It's been dying since they got rid of PvP in the um, wilderness. So. And that's unfortunate. Because it's a fun game. It is a very fun game. And I do recommend it. If you've never played before. Or if you're younger. And you're looking for your first ever MMO. Besides, like, you know, Fortnite or whatever. Something that's not, you know, a shit, a shit show. Oh, I recommend this. I really do. It's easy to jump into. It's easy to understand. It, you know. You can make a hardcore character. Granted, your character does not die forever. Which is... I don't know why they didn't do that, but I guess they can't really delete a character on their end. So, maybe you can go into the forum. Oh, they got rid of forums, actually, or they're going to. Which is stupid, but whatever. You can probably contact them through support, maybe, and be like, Hey, my character died as a hardcore. Can you delete it? And they can probably pull up your your information like it did die here 
and they can maybe delete it that way. No guarantees, though. I mean, I don't know. I don't know how that works. Well, and I'm playing on hardcore Iron Man, so if I die, you would think that you know my character is deleted, but no, it's not. It just goes from hardcore to regular Iron Man, which I'm fine with. Like whatever. I could count it as one life, but you don't really die in RuneScape unless you're being stupid. And being stupid in RuneScape is hard to do. <laughs> it's impossible. It's literally impossible to die in RuneScape unless you're unless you're new to the game. Well, hi, Mr. Kitty. Did I wake you up? Or did you wake up on your own? I can see your butthole. You're mooning me, little boy. Hey, I can see your butt. And if you think I'm pressing all the buttons down there, <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> the game's doing that for me. As long as it's in um, a certain game mode and um, your skills are in it, yellow bar, it does it for you. You can, however, change it out of the game mode and put it in manual, and then you have to push the buttons yourself, but why? There's no point to that, honestly. Is that the game do it for you because the game knows how to do it. It knows the rotation. And if you are new to my channel and you're wondering why I'm recording RuneScape, I mean it's something to play. It's a fun game. I know I have a strict rule about playing online games. Granted, I did play a bit of ESO on my channel. I deleted those videos because I'm basically done with ESO. Like, I've done basically everything I want to do. I could play some more, but the game is too easy. The enemies in the game except for the world bosses are are too easy and yet the developers keep nerfing every everything they keep nerfing the players no <laughs> why nerf the players when you can buff the enemy health it makes no sense they would rather nerf or weaken us players by 30% or more then do the smart thing and just double or triple the enemy health the ones that are trash mobs was this majority of the game I mean so that's why I quit playing it plus I went to play it one day well a couple days ago and my controller was not working properly. Actually, I wonder. Yeah, see, it, it was doing this for the right stick. And it shouldn't be doing that in ESO. I couldn't, and I had to press and hold the button to open the map. And pressing option, or, to, you know, get the menu open. The pause menu. <laughs> what pause menu? But well, you guys know what I mean. It wouldn't do it. It wouldn't bring up the correct menu for 
console controls. It was bringing up the mouse and keyboard menu. But I also had to press and hold it. So they did something on their end to screw it up. So I was like, I'm done, whatever. I'll just uninstall it, get the 100 gigs of space back that it takes up for future games that I'm going to play for my for my YouTube channel. I'll, delete, I'll just delete the videos. I'll cancel my subscription, my optional subscription, unlike Final Fantasy XIV. <coughs> and I just won't play anymore. I mean, I can play mouse and keyboard. No big deal. But I prefer a controller because I'm more used to controller. If I can play RuneScape with controller, I would. But I can't. Like, if I could, if I could walk around with... Actually, can I? No. That's, okay, so that's camera and that's the mouse. And that's how fast the mouse moves with controller. That's just the camera with controller. Yeah, if, if they had actual proper controller input for, for this, I would be so happy. I would, I, mmm. I would be happy as hell if they had that, but they don't. <coughs> Excuse my cough, I inhaled smoke yesterday. Cigarette smoke. And, yeah. I didn't mean to, but the person who was smoking came into the car window and it just blew right in my mouth. As I was breathing at the same time. So. I'll be coughing for a few days. If not a few months because of it. Which is unfortunate. And no, I don't have the plandemic. I can still smell and taste. And yes, I did say plan because it was a plan. There's proof behind it, too. They want us dead. And you know what? Screw them. Once I get to level 30 attack, I will go back up and start mining and whatnot for basically a very long time so I can get to level 30 smithing. Actually, what can I mine right now? Hold on, I'm curious. Better coal rocker tonight? What the hell are rocker two nights? I can use a steel pickaxe. Nice. Coal. I wish they got. I wish they would get rid of the um. The stamina. I really do. Yeah, I don't like that at all. I really don't. I can hear him mine or uh, swinging his sword. That explains why. That explains why. Why is he here fighting, dude? Like, he can go fight the and coups for goodness sakes. Come on now. Oh, he's doing the basic gameplay. Yeah, he's doing the basic stuff. He's doing the legacy combat, which is no, which is fine. That's why he's not doing any skills. But I'm seeing it as higher numbers because of his um because of what I have it on. I 
actually, I wonder how, how high would I hit if I switched it over to be hitting elevens. So he's hitting eights, no, eighty. I'll be hitting... No? I don't know. I might switch it back and see. I'm curious. <clears throat> Was that a 25? Damn, dude. That's not bad. I'm curious. I'm gonna switch it back real quick. Yeah, so that's the combat change. I don't know why that doesn't have it to where you can turn it off. Um, let me see here. Gameplay. Combat mode. Legacy. 190 health. Okay. Tens. 27. That's not bad, dude. Shit, dude. Okay. 16. But then I won't get the stamina at all. Yeah. <clears throat> I don't get the stamina. But which one's faster to kill them? I think it's the same speed. I really do. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's the same speed. Oh, hey, okay, cool. I can do that. Okay. Oh, we'll use that too then? No, it won't. Threshold abilities. Familiar. Oh, I don't have that because that's for, um... So then I can bring in... Hold on. Combat ability smash. How do I get this up with my actual thing, you know? No, right here, I think. No? Here it is. Where's Smash? Right here? Meteor strike. Oh, two handed. Okay. And this is four. I already have that one out. Okay. Oh, shoot, dude. I can use that one. Havoc. 
Ultimate, okay. Hurricane, oh, that's two handed weapons. That's dual wheel, that's two handed as well. Barge, flurry. I don't see smash though, like. <coughs> I don't see smash. Hide members. I don't see that one at all in the list. I have level 20 combat ability smash slice backhand lesser havoc why is it not there for us weird So I have level 20, but it's not there. I don't see the symbol for it. Havoc. Okay, there's Havoc. And there's this one, Forceful Backhand. Okay, there's Smash. Okay, so I can't use it because it takes two-handed. Okay. Fair enough. Move 10 tiles towards the target. Deals 3 times damage if the target moves. And it should use that then, right? Because it's an ultimate ability and I clicked to use those. Flurry, okay. Why isn't that on there? That's weird. Dismember. And it does bleed. Oh wow, my first AoE. Holy crap. Okay, so that's for two handed only. Do two-handed weapons attack more than one target? Do two-handed weapons attack more than one target? Interesting. If that's the case... Destroy. Berserk members only. What does it do though? Oh, and the cooldown is a minute. No thanks. Not worth it. Decimate. PvP damage is increased by if target is wearing a shield. Well, I don't do 
PvP because PvP is full of freaking cheaters in every game because reasons. <laughs> Members. That's fine. I don't care. Siphon. Steal 10% from the target every minute. No thanks. Who need. Dude, that's not worth it. Every minute, it's not worth it at all. I'm sorry. So that's just a taunt. Okay. Special weapon attack. And the rest of it's all member stuff, yeah. <laughs> So there's only two good ones out of the heart. Okay, so let's try this out. I'm curious. I might have to re um adjust the order. So you know what? Let's just do this and then this. And it should do that now. Cause it goes in order. It's not using this the Y. I have it set to where it's supposed to use it, but it's not. Yeah. Huh. Maybe because I don't need it? Is that why? Because by the time I actually get to that point, I don't really need it. Or is it because of the um, order of all the skills? It doesn't really do much, but I mean... What if I... If I did that, oh, yeah, it's definitely order. Okay. Yeah, it's definitely order. And now it's not using number seven at all. Which... I don't really need stun. <laughs> I don't really need it at all. Because it's only 1.2 seconds. They attack every... Like, whatever. I'd rather have one that does more damage than anything, so. Oh, dude, that is so nice. Holy crap, dude. And it uses all my, which is fine. So you're not really worth it. You're not worth it either. Okay, how about...
Fury. And it had, okay, yeah, I could, I could do that too. It used Punish first, but why? Why did it use Punish first? It's not first in line. Let's just do that then, I'm curious. Because I want that times extra damage if I can get it to work right. Dude, the timing on that. Oh my god, dude. That is so nice. So can I get the timing for... Yes! Okay. I didn't really need it there, but it is what it is. It is what it is, though. Who cares, man? <coughs> and that was below half, and then next hit. That was not double damage. I'm sorry. <laughs> And it dies. Oh my god, that is so perfect. I love it. <laughs> that is perfect. Now it should do... Yeah. So it's not really double damage or anything. No, it, it is. Okay. Is it based on what I have equipped? Oh, it took it off. Oh, wow. It took it off. Yeah, it took that one off. Interesting. So 109, okay. It is. Is it loses numbers? Okay. So it is based on what I have equipped. Interesting. Interesting. I'm, I mean, a 10 second duration. I mean, if it lasted for 20 seconds, sure. But it's not really worth it to me, I'm sorry. Nice little finisher there, I love it.
300 is not bad. Could be better though, but whatever. They'll get there eventually with better weapons and whatnot. More strength. Definitely more strength, for sure. Ashes, huh? Huh. Can you scatter these, I wonder? Herb lore! What? Getting closer, which is nice. Ooh, money. Not that I need money, but I'll take it in case I do need it, because you never know. Now to go mining. Joyous days. <coughs> Alright, so I can mine. See, there's only 
tin and bronze in there. Well, tin and copper. And then there's, I think, silver in there too. I can't really do much with silver. I need to find, um... Oh, there's iron. I can make iron, because I'm wearing iron right now. So, I can... Okay. Yeah, so I can get iron. And work with that, I guess. It's a level 30. Because there's no coal in there at all. No, there's not any coal in there. <clears throat> what can I do with silver ore, though? I don't think that will get my blacksmith thing up at all. I really, I mean, it might, but I don't know. Coal's right there. So I can make steel. Probably nowhere near. <coughs> hmm. Clay. Okay, all right. Thank God for the box. That's all I can say. <laughs> And I can't go up there. Okay. Crafting guild. Clan camp. Play. <clears throat> Mithril is right there. Level 30. Okay. <clears throat> but I also need level 30 to work it, though, right? Yes. Smelt Mithril bars 25% faster. Gold. What can I do with silver? Because I can mine silver, but can I work smelter, um, silver? I cannot yet. But what can I do with it, though? Crafting. I can turn it into bars. Hmm. <coughs> Nothing here. Okay. Yeah, so there's not glorious, huh? I do have some of these though already. 
So you can't really do nothing with So you cannot turn silver into bars. Then what do you do with it then? Interesting. What in the world is this? Okay, that's weird. Oh, how do you craft this? Level 90 for dragon? Armor lump, slice, and armor shard. <coughs> So I guess dragon armor is still the best armor in in the game then. Interesting. Hold on, let's try, let's go down here then. Hold on, I'm curious. No, it's not. Elden Rune. Elder Rune is the best armor now. So why even bother going for dragon armor? When you just do this, unless you want to look cool, I guess. I don't know. Obsidian, huh? Why is obsidian so low? That's weird. Five hundred armor. That's better than freaking. Oh no, this was over here. That's the strongest armor. Holy shit, that's cool. <coughs> huh. Yeah, so the chain body is the same. 195 Huh <coughs> Oh, you can't just you can't just do it, you have to do the process. What does it get though? Five more bars, that's fine. <coughs> oh shit, more defense. That's actually kind of worth it. What? <laughs> what? Dude. Holy crap, dude. What in the fuck is this, dude? Oh, that does not say I want Okay, what? Five hundred from... And it isn't safe for, for this at all. On what its stats are. 80k XP? Are you serious, dude? From 5k to 80k? Holy crap, dude. Are you serious? <laughs> no, I, I need my, I need my box. I need my box. I need my box. I guess been like, which means, yep. Alright, I want to go ahead and cut it here, and I will see you guys next time. Have a wonderful day.